Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And uh, one I don't often talk about, you know, having people update their drivers. I often tell you that if there's no problems, um, you know, just leave it alone. But this time around, it's something that maybe you want to do because there's a lot of people reporting how the performance of the PC has actually increased. Uh, thanks to an update for the Intel graphics adapter and the Intel uh, 7th to 10th generation uh, CPUs. So, uh, first of all, if you want to know, do, do you have an Intel uh, CPU that's supported, 7 to 10 generation, or if you have an Intel graphics processor in your PC, uh, right-click on the Start button and go into the Task Manager. The update is good for Windows 10 and Windows 11, by the way, and you can check out if you have, first of all, the um, an, an Intel 7th to 10th generation. How do you know? You'll see Intel Core, and you'll see a number. So i5, that's the, the class of CPU, but the number following it, the first one here tells you what generation. So in my case, 8259, it's an 8th generation Intel CPU. If you have 7259 or 7, starts with a 7, Seven generation, nine, nine generation, and if you have ten thousand something, you're a tenth generation. You are in the category for the update. The other thing is, of course, you can look at your GPU. If you have an Intel GPU, if you have two, by the way, if you have a gaming laptop, maybe um, you might have an Intel GPU on one, and then a Nvidia or something else on the other one. As long as you have one of your C GPUs is an Intel, um, that means you are going to have apparently some greatly improved performance by downloading this driver. So this is the Intel page for downloading the driver for graphics. So here it says Intel 7 to 10 generation processor graphics. Uh, so you have it here. You click the download button. This is good for Windows 11 and Windows 10 and it will update your graphics adapter uh, to the latest version. I applied it on this machine, actually, if I go into my device manager and look at the display adapters, uh, my Intel Iris graphics here, and look at the driver, you can see that it has been updated with the latest driver number. Uh, and this was released, actually, at the end of May, 24th, May 2023. So it's been around for a few weeks. But now we're talking about how it actually improves a lot of the performances. And if you game on your computer with the basic Intel graphics processor, a lot of people have noted that the games also perform better. So click the download, then you click the file to install it. And uh, that should be um, at least, even if you don't see any performance increase, at least you'll have the latest driver. But from what I see, a lot of people are saying that they really, really have a lot of the uh, of the drivers um, available. So here you see the latest, and it says here that it was released on the 15th of June. So uh, probably um, the driver was done in late May, but June is the uh, latest uh, release. So check it out. If you are in that category, you might actually find that there's a improved performance. The link is in the description below. Just click on it and install it and restart your PC. And uh, hopefully, this is going to improve your performance on your computer. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.